It's official. College athletes in South Carolina will soon be able to profit off their name, image, and likeness. The governor held a signing ceremony today in Clemson. Our Asia Wilson is live tonight to break down what this means and who it impacts. Well, guys, in short, this bill will allow any student in the state, any student athlete that is in the state, to be compensated for the use of their name, image, and likeness by third parties unaffiliated for, with their schools. This means that they will be able to develop their own personal brands. Governor Henry McMaster's ceremonial signing on Monday afternoon will soon change the game for student athletes across the state. This new law is an exercise in free enterprise that allows those who have attracted the attention and achieved a certain status for in athletics, particularly to be recognized for that. He's referring to Senate Bill 685, the compensation of collegiate athletes. It will allow students to profit off their name, image, and likeness through things like endorsement and autograph deals in social media. Something Clemson running back Darren Rencher says has been a long time coming. Now we have the opportunity to build our brands, build personal platforms, and to think that you couldn't be able to use what you achieved to, to have monetary value or merchandise value it's kind of un-American. Clemson University Athletics say this is not a pay for play type of situation, adding that institutions will not be involved with any of the deals. Athletes can hire agents to help with that. Through a set of rules and regulations, their ability to have representation, these will be real wages for them, so they will have to pay taxes on them. Governor McMaster said this will not interfere with athletes' academic performance. Lawmakers say instead, student athletes will now be put on the same level of playing field as students at universities who earn money. We'll have a chance to earn uh, things that I feel like we've achieved, just like any other student on campus. So they have a gift, they have a talent, they have a, something they want to do, they have a platform, they can use that. Bottom line, universities will help educate athletes on the do's and don'ts in the name, image, and likeness as they prepare for their futures and make a better life for themselves. Because you've worked so hard to build something that is yours and you shouldn't be uh, penalized for good work. Now, this bill will go into effect July 1 of next year. Officials tell me this will give them a year to uh, work out any kinks before it becomes active. Tonight, we're live in Clemson. Asia Wilson, 7 News. Asia, thank you. South Carolina.